Hey everybody, John Muller from the JP Muller Group, and I want to talk to you a little bit today about some uh, features that I added to 7.3 um, and also 7.2. So really it's a cumulative version 7.3 that we're going to look at. Um, these are based on user suggestions, and as always I consider them, and if uh, they make sense to put in, I, I'll go back and I will update the sheet accordingly. In this case, um, one user pointed out that the shading of days in the Gantt chart, so here the non-working days, for example, um, while that makes sense when you're looking at a Gantt chart by day, if you're looking at it by month or by week, it doesn't necessarily uh, make any sense because all you're showing is the column representing the whole week, not that particular day per se. So right here is a day view, and you'll see that we have the highlighted columns. But if I go to preferences and change this to either a week or a month view, and I'll do that, let's change it to week, and we'll go back in to the project plan view, and notice we're going by weeks, but we don't highlight any of the columns. Similarly for months, same thing. Or we don't gray them out per se. Say we don't gray anything out. So even if the first day of one of those months is a holiday or a non-working day, we'll still leave it kind of with a white background. And um, that makes a little bit more sense. So thank you to our users for that suggestion. Um, another change that we made here is the ability to change the column headings. So a lot of folks uh, are using this in other countries and they want the headings here to be in their local languages. Um, if you change it right here on the main page, it'll cause the scripts to break. So we also added is the ability to change it on the preferences. So we have a section here for the project plan headings and one for the action items. So let's say I want to change the end. In some countries, it's FIM. I'll change it to FIM, and when I go back, you'll notice that it says FIM now. And um, we could do that for any of those columns. And as long as we change the headings from the Preferences tab, the scripts will continue to work properly. Thanks for tuning in.